Hey there. So this place is around five miles away from my home. I arrived here by scooter. And now it's so warm. And I'm feeling so great. I find it really nice that there's still places really close by that I haven't even ventured yet. This place I have never been before and I really like how it looks. Hopefully you like these forest videos as much as I like to do them because this is something really important to me and I feel really good if you can enjoy it as well. As you can see from my eyes, I haven't had too much sleep lately. It's not that I haven't been sleepy, but I've had so much stuff to do and I've been talking to someone throughout the night. So even though I may look tired, I am extremely energetic and happy. But I hope that I will get some sleep now, because my summer job is going to start and I really need to make my sleeping rhythm for something of a normal human being. Isn't that twisted? Okay, so now I just went back home to get my scarf before I get the sunburn and I think I will now show you uh, one place that is quite close to my heart because I've been there so many times. It's the place where I started to make films. I filmed a couple short movies with my sister and my cousin there and also I've always went there just to Get, get me my own time, you know, to get relaxed and just think about stuff. I've always been quite bad at telling people how I feel, even though I would like to say a lot. But it, I guess I'm just not cut out for that socially. I think I've improved last years, but still I can be a bit hard socially sometimes, so please bear with me. But I also do like the idea about nonverbal communication. You can tell a lot by your facial gestures, and if you're just being honest to yourself, you'll get your message across non-verbally as well. What do you see when you look at these tracks? Perhaps you see just a mixture of iron and steel and some wood laying underneath. Maybe you see 
the childhood trips you took by these exact railroads. You may even see a couple faces of friends who have lost their lives because of these train tracks. Okay, so I finally found the place. I haven't been here for a couple years and it has changed a lot to the extent that I don't even recognize it anymore which is kind of sad to me because this used to be a field but now it has all these new trees that have been planted and it almost looks like a maze when you go there but I think I will stop talking and go through the maze with you if that's okay
that's about it from this time. I just wanted to thank you all for watching my videos and I'm so happy if they have been helpful to you in any way. Just remember to cherish the present, be grateful of everything and don't take things for granted. I feel so grateful at the moment and happy. I'm in a good place for sure. So thank you for being there.